a standing ovation in tears Monday night as the Charlotte City Council voted unanimously to accept changes recommended by the Citizens Review Board Task Force. This process involved not just the task force members, but there were opportunities for the community at large to participate in this revision. The Citizens Review Board allows people to challenge disciplinary decisions by the Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department. The task force was formed after a study by the Charlotte School of Law and a subsequent article published by the Charlotte Observer back in April, which shows that the CRB, which has been in place since 1998, has never ruled in favor of citizens. We are making this process more fair. More open. The changes, which are effective immediately, make it easier for residents to appeal to the board and offers more transparency by publishing resources to help residents through the process. Also, there are no lower standards of review to get a hearing, and the Citizens Review Board will have access to the entire internal affairs file. I can tell you that after working for the past six months with 17 members of the task force, I no longer had the concerns I had in April. My concern then was would there be complete, honest, open review of the CRB process? Yes, there has been. This is a huge victory for the city of Charlotte. It's something that stands as a standard for us, can act as a template for other cities across North Carolina and across the country. I think that in the future what we'd be looking forward to is seeing the state actually address the issue of subpoena power and hopefully instill that within our board. We would also like to see boards such as, uh, in towns such as Salisbury, uh, Fayetteville, as well as the boards in Greensboro and Durham be able to adopt some of these changes. I am thrilled. I think this is not just a victory and great and great an identity for the city of Charlotte, but it's also a victory for other cities across the country. But I think that what we'll see from these amendments is indeed a more transparent process, a stronger realization by the community that there is a great deal of oversight of the CNPD. The board cannot question officers if a complaint is brought against them and recommend changes to the review process through city council. For Creative Loafing Charlotte, this is Kendria Mecca, as always, in these streets.